Howdy, everybody. It's your pal, Misty. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. I decided to bring y'all in the car with me again. It's been a minute since we've driven anywhere. Ooh, that's a steep hill. So I thought it would be fun to pick y'all up and take y'all for a little drive. And while we take a little drive, let's talk about a keto side effect that I get from time to time, which again, I'm no medical expert. I only know what happens to my body when I do keto. So if this hasn't happened to you, that's great. But if it has, sometimes just knowing that it's a thing that happens to people can make you feel better about it. So the thing that happens to me is I get a rash. I don't know why exactly I get the rash, but they even call it the keto rash, just like people talk about the keto flu. I think the keto flu is because people don't get their electrolytes in. They underestimate how important they are when they're first starting keto especially. So, <clears throat> I don't really suffer from a keto flu. Um, even after cheat days, going back into ketosis, I don't know if it's because I'm already pretty well fat adapted and it happens pretty quickly, but for whatever reason, every few months, if I'm doing what most people would say really good, um, you know, not having any of them cheat days people talk about, no free days for me, about, it's varied, but between three and six weeks of doing a really low carb, under 20 net grams of carbs, is what I mean when I say that. Having that low carb for three to six weeks and I get a rash on my abdomen. I don't know why, but it is so itchy. Like, oh, it itches. I wake up and I have just ripped open the skin on my stomach. I have little bitty tiny, you know, sores from where the rash was and I scraped it with my fingers because I'm sleeping and uh, if I'm awake I try not to scratch it but when you're sleeping you're sleep how do you not scratch when you're sleep I don't, I don't I don't really know I don't get it um but anyway so I get a rash and the way that I fix the rash is I have a free day and by free day I mean I eat carbs so there's a bunch of different ways you can do it some days I just some days it's happened this is the third time it's not like it's frequent but it has happened more than once i've heard that some people just get it once some people do get it recurring um the time frame has varied for me between the last three times that i've gotten it uh, between that three and six week ratio so i don't know i just kind of wanted to put it out there for people to hear that if you do keto uh, you may get a rash <clears throat> I don't think it's always on the abdomen either, like it's different for everybody, but just be aware that that is a possible side effect that you could have from keto. I mean, I'm not going to complain too much that every, you know, month or so my body goes, hey, you need a free day, have some carbs. I'm not going to be big mad about that. It's a day to have some carbs, um, but I am going to try when it happens to to do a little bit better on what kinds of carbs I eat, not just while out and have a big old Dr. Pepper or, uh, you know, eight tacos, which when you see this, it will be National Taco Day. So unrelated, but go have a taco. Oh, and so it'll be Lola's birthday. Lola's born on National Taco Day. Happy birthday, Lola. Um, she's four now. She's our little heart warrior. Actually, I'm wearing her friend's um, shirt, CT, CT Strong. So, pray for both of them, our little heart warriors, all the little heart warriors. Um, sorry, I got distracted by tacos and then Lola's birthday. Then that's why we don't drive and do vlogs, because you can't stay focused, Misty. But hope, hope y'all are having fun, and thanks for coming along. Um, <clears throat> so, rash. I get it. It's frustrating and itchy, and I fix it with carbs. Healthier carbs, not tacos. Um... Because I can have low-carb tacos, which I'm sure I'll do on Sunday. I'll probably have some of the steak-y, steak 
whatever, whichever kind I have, the thin one. Um, you know, we gotta focus on my park. The thin one, so whichever one, I'll probably have tacos. So, have you a taco today if you're watching this on Sunday? Even if you're not watching this on Sunday, have a taco today, because tacos are great. Um, but know that, yeah, uh, some people on keto get a rash, and I'm one of those people. So I have a free day. I had, in fact, I don't think I said, because I got very distracted, but I had Panda Express uh, white rice with their teriyaki chicken, no sauce, because it's just grilled chicken that way. And I thought that would be an interesting thing to try because I do know they do steamed veggies too, so maybe that could be an actual keto meal. Um, or just keep it low carb. I could have had the sauce because I was doing the carbs, but I didn't because I just wanted to see what their grilled chicken would taste like. It wasn't bad. It wasn't great. It was just a very regular grilled chicken, but it, for what it was, it was good. Um, and it, the rash is gone. I still have some bumps. Um, Mom said maybe next time try gold bond powder, so I'm going to look for some of that just in case. Well, I'm assuming it will continuously happen. Um, Right now, I don't have any plans of building in any free days. I'm just going to sort of see what my body says and uh, go from there. So that's where we are. Just a quick little video. Thanks for coming along with me because it's been a minute since we've been driving anywhere in the car. Just to drive somewhere in the car. And then, like I said, thought I'd bring y'all along. Um, the weather's been great. And now we're rambling. So we're just going to go ahead and uh, close out this video. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you know how. Um, hit the bell notifications if you'd like to know when I put out a video. Because obviously you can't ever really tell. Well, you'll get one on Sundays. That's the given. Around 2 or 2.15 depending upon when it lets me post it. Because it keeps changing. But around 2 or 2.15. Or at 2 or 2.15 central. Uh, on Sundays, and then sometimes Wednesdays, sometimes Fridays, this week is Thursday because it's my mama's birthday, so just subscribe and hit the notifications if you're interested in watching. Otherwise, until next time, I'll see you real soon.